Hello, my name is Wade Nimmer and this is Rotary Serving Our Community. Recently, uh, we had a couple here travel to Sri Lanka to do a project and I wanted to bring them in because uh, unfortunately, Sri Lanka is one of the areas in the world I have not yet been to. So with me today, I have Helena and Hans Dahlen. Welcome. Thank you. Thank you. I'm going to start with you, Hans. Tell us a little bit about yourself. Uh, I was born and raised in Sweden. Grew up in a city a couple of hours south of capital Stockholm. I'm an engineer and uh, fortunately my work got me here to California when the company decided to have a facility to move to Golita and I and my family traveled with them in 2004. So we moved here and we have stayed ever since. <laughs> nice, nice. Yeah. How about you? Tell us a little bit about yourself. I'm one. <laughs> <laughs> uh, actually, I'm coming from the same hometown as Hans, and we met over there over 30 years ago, wow. so that's a long time. <laughs> so actually, I was actually a kindergarten teacher, and I've been working for that for 30 years. Wow. But now I actually have dropped that work, and I work as a photographer. This is my kind of my dream profession, so that's my new goal to start that, and that feels fine. Very nice. So how did you get involved with Rotary? Actually, I was growing up in this world because my dad was a long-time Rotarian oh. and my mother was actually an Inner Wheel member. Okay. So I was starting with as an Inner Wheel member for over 15 years before I was coming to Rotary <laughs> practically. Wow. So I have been growing up since I was a little kid, so I know kind of the things here. So right, right. It feels good. And how about you, Hans? Uh, I did know a little bit about Rotary because of my father-in-law but uh, I was never a member in Sweden. But when I was uh, coming over here, it was one time where a Swedish friend came, uh, a Swedish Rotarian friend came to Santa Barbara and he invited me to go to his, uh, his um, meeting there for, uh, what was it called? Makeup. Makeup, yeah. Mm -hmm. So I went with him there on no. the meeting and uh, that was in 2008. And then I was a member after that. Okay. Yeah. And the member of which club? You guys got to plug in for your club. Yeah. They're, yeah, they're going to be watching you. So. Of course. Yeah. Kalina Noontime. Oh, yeah. Of course. Kalina Noontime. Good for you. Yeah. Great. So um, tell us a little, a little bit about the project. What, what project was it in Sri Lanka and what um, kind of drew you to that project? It uh, started uh, in 2012, five years ago. And it was uh, Darshan Yon that was a uh, past district governor from Colombo East Club kind of started this project and he reached out to his uh, former colleagues in our district it was Frank Ortiz. So Frank Ortiz had uh, lots of presentations around that time so we were listening to this at conferences and we got interested in Sri Lanka. Uh, during that time 2012-13 it was about four different grants was going on at the same time in this district. So it was many clubs that was participating, and Golita Noon Time was one of the clubs participating in that. So after, after that, it was kind of fading down a little bit from our part. But then in 2014, uh, it uh, started up again because we wanted to go to Sri Lanka to find out what uh, this project was about. So we went there, the family went there in 2014. And uh, Darshan Jan contacted us when we were there and said, hey, you're doing a great job. Do you want to continue this and take the lead on this and do another global grant? And we accepted his offer. So after that, we started a global grant in 2015, 16. And then we did another global grant last year. No, this year, fifth, uh, 17. That was just okay. finished. And what kind of grant was it? It was it's actually a global grant. Global yeah. grant, yeah. Um, focusing on on education? Education, education, yes. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So we're actually going to start this third grand global grant just in a few weeks here now. Okay. So, it's going so education, is it for grammar school, preschool? No, it's for preschool teachers because they passed the law uh, in 2010 that all the preschool teachers must have a diploma. Uh -huh. And they didn't have that at that time. So that's why the project got started in 2012 to help those teachers that doesn't afford to have a diploma. So it's a teaching program that's going on for uh, one year. And we sponsor them with the money to go to these uh, training centers to do the training for one year. So they actually work during the weekdays and do the training on the weekends, Saturday, Sunday for one year. So the Global Grant is actually um, training or teaching uh, 
teachers, instructors, yeah, 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 getting yeah. them ready to, to get the diplomas. Nice, very yeah. nice. Yeah. Okay. So that's very good. Great. So that's how actually grown so much over the years. And now actually this is the biggest and the most important project, Sri Lankan project ever. Really? Uh, uh, so that grows and grows and it's going to be bigger and bigger yeah, yeah. the whole time. Good for you. Yeah. Yeah. And it's going to benefit nothing but the people. So. Absolutely. Yeah, that's perfect. That, that feels good. You brought some pictures. Let's take a look at your pictures. Uh, first picture we have is a picture of uh, you hiding behind a camera. <laughs> Yeah, so, yeah, tell us a little bit stuff. about that that picture. Actually, we were preparing just before we left. We were preparing all stuff with all the boxes and everything with <laughs> backpacks and everything. And Hans was kind of concerned. Have you all the camera stuff with you now and everything that we're, we're going to go for the camera lenses? And we kind of have a, a photographer and kind of documentary mm -hmm. all things together. And that we usually do during our trips too. Okay. Promote everything afterwards. Now the boxes, if I recall, mm -hmm. you grabbed some of our t-shirts. I know, oh, we did. So that's in boxes I like I know. We, along with the solar lights. I know. The, the there was yeah. really good, actually. Nice, there was a really nice. good handout. So this project this is not just to educate and help the teachers. We even had a special hands-on project on the side to uh, help the preschools with material, too. But that's a kind of the set special thing for us to okay. do on, on the side. So it feels good, and the people, and especially the kids are, and the, the teachers are so happy and so relaxed with that. So that's what we're going to continue with. So how did you get all that over there? That's yeah, that's question. another thing, yeah. <laughs> but we actually, we've had one backpack each. Okay. And one box each. Okay. That's the rule. <laughs> yeah, okay. So regular check-in. Yeah. Okay, gotcha. Yeah. Okay. But uh, it's important to say that the global grant, as Helena said, it's about uh, funding uh, money for the teachers, mm -hmm. uh, t training. And this uh, thing with uh, moving boxes full with uh, educational material is more like a hands-on side project. Okay. That's not part of the global grant. Okay, got it. But we like to, as most Rotarians, li Rotarians like, sure. is uh, to have hands-on work. So you that's bet. why we. You oh, bet. Really no, that's like good. That. Good for so you. Yeah. Yeah. This to, the, to the preschools. Yeah. We, are, we are actually <laughs> collecting a lot of preschool material from actually the area over here and brought it in boxes and take them over there. Okay. So this is the second time you're doing that. Good, good. Next picture we have is a picture of you. Um, I couldn't figure that one out. What, this, the, the, with boxes still, it's just you guys getting ready and packing up. Yeah, that's it. Uh, that's kind of the finished Santa product of what you're going to try. Oh, yeah, that's what I'm going to have. Santa okay, Barbara. I got you. Santa Barbara Airbus. Okay, no, oh, good, good. And then uh, you have a map here showing mm -hmm. us the locations that you went to. Yeah. So this is, uh, the dots here are training centers that are located in Sri Lanka. Okay. And the red dots are uh, funded by, supported by District 5240. Oh, wow. So most of the dots you can see is the red ones from our district. Very nice. Good job. So we are the leading district. I can see that. <laughs> and then uh, the next picture we have is of the school itself. Yeah, this is the, the first visit, preschool visit we we did uh, in Jaffna, mm -hmm. and we were staying there for almost two hours and handed out the preschool materials and was looking for if we can do some more things in the in the future, or what kind of uh, environment they were looking for, and it was a great experience to see. I was surprised that there was even better standard than I mm -hmm. actually expect. Mm -hmm. So it feels so interesting to f see all this, and um, our youngest daughter, Sarah, was actually kind of showing all all the kids here, uh, the materials that we brought. Okay, um, so that's your daughter there? Yes, the youngest one. She's oh. a teacher too. So. Oh, she is? Okay. Yeah. Uh, so she went with you? Yeah. The three of you went? Yeah. I see. Okay, great. In 2014, we went all four. Wow. All, both uh, daughters. Oh, that's great. Uh, next picture you have shows uh, probably one of the teachers then? Yeah. Yeah, one of the teachers. Teaching. Okay. Uh, so our request from the, the part over there was that uh, we would like to meet the teachers that were going to go to the diploma ceremony the day after. Okay. So we, we met up with the teachers at two different preschools where they're going to. So this is one of the teachers that had the diploma and got next, next day, the Saturday. Great. Great. And you have uh, another picture here of uh, part of the school then? Yeah, they're actually been doing a lesson. Okay. So the teachers was uh, holding and uh, we were watching everything and were actually being very involved and active ah. in the whole process. Nice. Oh yeah, nice. that was good. And then um, picture with you there. Oh uh, yeah, doing something a here. Yeah. Uh, we were actually handing out uh, wooden toys. 
oh. in the boxes, from the boxes, and the kids were so eager to see what we were doing with it, and were eager to be involved in the in the process too. So of course they were all over the place yeah, in yeah. the classroom. So where did the toys come from? They were actually from another Rotary club here in the area, oh. like Coneo Valley. Yeah. Okay. So Valley. yeah, some mm. have supported and there are a nice. lot of other interact I've, I've seen those now that you mentioned it. I know. Yeah. Yeah. They're good. Okay. They're really good actually. They are very nice. Yeah. So then the next picture is uh, you are uh, doing a banner exchange there. Oh yeah. Yeah. Yeah, 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 we do. Yeah, we good. Good. So one of the teachers, uh, the left teacher on the left side uh, was the one that was going to get the diploma. Okay. The other one uh, got through this program uh, one year ago. So wow. she had gone through this program also. Great, great. And the banners, they leave at the school or? They are staying in the school. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, oh, still. very nice. Just to have it kind of remember us. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. And then the next picture you have is another school or is that the same they school? They sit actually same the same school, school just okay. before we are leaving. And kind of the kids was actually very funny with this because we had kind of a cheering club and they were so happy to see us and it was hard to leave them. Yeah, yeah. sure it would I be. Know, but they were of course you're going to go back. So yeah, they yeah. were asking, are you coming back tomorrow? Yeah, Please? tomorrow. Or are you coming back and play <laughs> with us cute. tomorrow? <laughs> very cute. So that was great. Good. And, and the kids over here, but they were fun and and then we are playing a lot with them, so. Now you have a video clip, right, of, of this? Uh, yeah, we have. So why don't we go yeah. ahead and take a look at that Absolutely. and see. And if, yeah. uh, if you can, uh, you could talk over and explain to us what you're seeing in, in the video because uh, of course, yes. it sounds like a, well, I get the trip out of it this way. I uh, can see this like. So Jaffna, that's um, the location then? Of yeah, the school, it's going so? to Jaffna. It's the northern part of, of Sri Lanka. Oh, okay. And the war, civil war ended in 2009, so it's still burned out houses. There. Yeah, see that. So this is kind of the poorest area in the whole country, so okay. that's why we are focusing on this. Is this the school that was in the pictures there? Yeah, this is yeah. From, the pit, uh, from the school we visited. <laughs> yeah, like welcoming ceremony. Nice. And they are talking Tamil, so it's kind of hard to understand. We had them translated with okay. us too, and, it, okay. and are, uh, one or two was helping us uh, there with the, with the language too. Mm -hmm. so. Beautiful school though. I very know, the nice. quality was very high, uh, um, and it was very fun to see, and I was so surprised and very happy mm -hmm. with the quality, uh, sure. more than I ever expected. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it was better than the East Coast where we were in 2014. Yeah. And they were very eager to show and tell us everything they have gone through <laughs> so far. And, and we had a lot of help. The man in yellow shirt uh, mm -hmm. is uh, president of the Jaffna Club. Okay. Rotary Club. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. And the man in blue shirt is an educator and he's uh, part of a teaching team for okay. the uh, training centers. Okay. <laughs> and they're singing and watching you. Let's see what they can do. Yeah. Oh, this is part of the picture that you showed us. Yeah. Part of the lesson plan. Yeah. And here the kind of lesson oh, plan I had very too. Good. A lot of discipline. Oh yeah, yeah. the whole time. <laughs> everything you see over there so is so very, different from yeah, what you're yeah. used to. Colorful too. Everything is. I know. Colorful. They are, their artwork is fantastic. <laughs> and. Um, so so all this these materials we brought actually from here. So we well, did, is, okay, yeah. including mm -hmm. this puzzle. Yeah, there. yeah, we did. Ah, okay. Come mostly from the Hollister School, in Galita. Okay. okay. The Hollister. Uh, uh, did they donate that then? Yeah, they did. Wow. Our yeah. youngest daughter is working there. Okay. So oh yeah, she helped us out, and supported us. They cleaned us. out things from the summer and then very nice. Okay. Very nice. Yeah, she's supporting them here too and showing them how to work with the material. Mm -hmm. And everybody was very eager to put, be be involved in this too. So yeah, um, I, I can't believe how orderly these uh, children are. <laughs> oh yeah. Yeah, that's wow. Man manner. Good yeah. manner. Yeah, I know. We were so surprised. Actually, <laughs> I'm very surprised. Oh, I know. I know. <laughs> so we couldn't have stayed there the whole day if you had the time. This is true. Yeah, absolutely. It was so amazing feeling. Now these children are they also coming from a lower income? Uh, demographic? Yeah, yeah, they are. Yeah, yes. they are. Okay. Well dressed, they're all in uniform. Yeah, they are supported in the community yeah. with these uniforms. So. I'm kind of surprised that the structure is so nice. I mean, they got floors, they got yeah, they they have pa everything painted walls, and they yeah. got a roof and ceiling that's not yeah. leaking. That's good. I know. That is good. 
So they are coming back very good after the war, civil war, they have been so good and they're coming back here. And the age of these children are how old? They are between three and five years old. Five years old. Yeah. <laughs> it's kind of the goodbye. Oh, okay. Yeah. Very good. Yeah, so it was hard to say goodbye to them. <laughs> they were eager to see us the next day. Yeah. <laughs> right. Well, very good. Well, thank you for sharing that one. Um, yeah. Now, how many of these schools did you actually get to visit on this trip? This trip was mm. just two schools. Just two schools. This, yeah, because the, the actual this, the travel schedule was so tight. Okay. So. Well, um, you told us to see twenty four hours by plane to get there, yeah. plus another seven hours by yeah. car. Yeah. Yeah. So oh was, my gosh. That yeah. was tough. You just from one thing to another thing. Yeah. The yeah. whole time. And how long were you there? We have totally the time we were there for three weeks. Three weeks. Yeah. Okay. But when we were there in 2014, we were at uh, three different preschools okay. on the East oh, Coast. Good. Very good. Now, you have one other video you brought for us, too. Did you want to show that one? That's kind of the ceremonies, correct? Oh, the yeah. graduating part. Yeah. yeah. So let's go ahead and jump into that one and see oh, yeah. what you have there of because course. I think that's unique and that's kind of part of what the project yeah, was all about. Yeah, but this is yes. kind of the yes. real highlight yeah, in, yeah. in the whole trip. Very good. So the, uh, the gentleman in the center would be... Um, He's uh, governor in the North District in Sri Lanka for the parliament. Okay, okay. And the rest of them are probably staff people? Actually, one I see of the, the press. You got good press coverage there. You oh, see yeah. the back of Darshan Yon there. Oh, is that Darshan there? Yeah. <laughs> And one member uh, is fractured from the school ministry. Okay. So if a few people that are from the from the government, the Sri Lankan government. Wow. Yeah. So there was a lot of celebrities, and we had no clue when we started the ceremony how big it's going to be. <laughs> yeah, Dashan didn't leave anything for us. He said, oh, <laughs> just be there and Sur you're going to have fun. Huh? Yeah, there was a that big surprise. <laughs> Yeah, I met with Darshan when he uh, came here to uh, our district. Oh, yeah. 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 So this was a very special feeling to be in wow. this ceremony and starting up. I and we had new clean in the beginning, but it's actually over 300 students who are going to take the graduation. Mm -hmm. So we are part of that, and then we really showed out that actually we are going to be actually one, one big part of mm -hmm. all the ceremony. Wow. And these are all the graduates? Yes. That's impressive. Yeah, it is. And the so, beautiful dresses and Now, everything. how much of that actually was was the global grant? This is uh, supported by the grant we did in 2015-16. Mm -hmm. And is it 100% of those? Is it 50% of those graduates? 100%. 100%. Oh, my gosh. Very good. That's a serious impact there. Oh, yeah. yeah. Very nice. So they're actually showing us the kind of the tradition of the, how the, everything works. Mm -hmm. I see. Uh, very, very traditional. Yeah, it was very powerful. It was uh, a very nice experience. Mm -hmm. So this is actually inside then? Yeah, After this is the inside. processional, then you're yeah. inside with the presentation. There. Yeah. Okay. And here's the, uh, govern the governor for the northern part of Sri Lanka. Mm -hmm. so that's a very big power in the whole country, actually, too. So okay. He's a former teacher, too. Oh, he is? Yeah. yeah. So he's uh, very involved with this one. I'm sure he appreciates the project. Absolutely, yes. absolutely. A really big supporter. Okay. okay. Yeah, so this is our early presentation prior to... Uh, prior to the, when they come up to stage and get the diplomas. Okay, okay, got it. So it was a lot of speakers. Before, uh, <laughs> I'm sure that's yeah. the case. But we were on stage actually the whole time. Oh my goodness! Oh yeah. So, so who's doing the camera work for you? <laughs> you our daughter? younger daughter. My, our daughter. Yeah. yeah. Very nice. And this is actual the graduating. So this is the, yeah. this is the teacher that we visited the day before. Yeah, yeah, okay. That's why I have this gift. Yeah. Nice. So we actually was giving out the diplomas and the medals. Um, Great. And that's. That was very powerful. It mm -hmm. was a very special feeling to mm. have been going through this. I'm sure that's the case. Oh, yeah. Because the teachers now became real. Yeah. Before they had been just the, the figure on the paper. True. But now yeah. we had them in front of us. Yeah, and, true. Really and how many did you actually graduate through this uh, grant? About 300 for this grant. Oh, my gosh. Oh, yeah. And there's much more to come in the future. <laughs> <laughs> we are far from done. Yeah. 
Very nice. Now, um, the teachers, are they already assigned to specific schools or are they going to be moving around to different areas, do you know? Oh, they are mostly assigned to where they work now. Okay. They're not likely moving around. Okay, okay. Also, they don't have enough money to travel so much. Mm -hmm. So this is you, so you get to do the uh, presentation also? Yeah, I actually have a short speech. Okay. And I'm starting actually in Singalese. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> wow, good for you. Yeah, I did it. I take the challenge too. Hey, good. <laughs> That's very good. I'm sure they appreciated it. Oh, yeah. It was actually kind of fun because everybody in the audience had no clue when I started up of what to do. <laughs> but uh, it was a great thing to, to do that. So. so how hard was the language to learn? It's kind of tricky, <laughs> but yeah. I have a few people around me who kind of help me. So. Oh, that's good. Very Especially good. the letters are hard <laughs> to read. I bet. Yeah. I bet that is. So you have to write phonetically, I'm sure. Oh, to, yeah. I to tried try everything. I tried everything. So tell us, um, on this trip, how much of a life-changing experience was that for you to do this project? Something that you uh, imagined, anticipated, uh, something unique? Uh, this was kind of a unique trip. I think it was the most uh, uh, interesting trip for, for us, I think, because it was so many people we met during yeah. this. So we got to learn and to meet with all the culture really up close because we lived in uh, Darshan's family also with him. Yeah. So it was very come close to the families. True. Now, had you ever imagined that you were going to end up in Sri Lanka doing a project like this <laughs> when you started Rotary? No. <laughs> no. Uh, but we yeah. have always liked international travels. And we have been uh, backpacking with uh, our children since they were very small. Oh, okay. We started when they were six and eight years old. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So we were backpacking in Asia many six years. Six and eight years old, that is a, mm -hmm. that's a long time ago. <laughs> yeah, and that's uh, pretty young to start them. Oh, Good yeah. for you. So, this is a, a logical path mm -hmm. on this uh, travel experience yeah. that we have. And we have done kind of different, this kind of projects before in the past, so it's kind of natural for us just to continue uh, things uh, in this way, and we're going to absolutely continue to do it in the future. So tell me, how much was the grant, was the global grant, the first one, the one that we just <coughs> saw? The first one in 1516 we did was 47,000, mm -hmm. and this one that we finished this summer was uh, 50,700. Nice, nice. So about $100,000 total mm. to put out that many teachers. Yeah. Wow. And the uh, cost great. for one teacher is about $100, 100 to $120 oh, really? yeah. per, per so teacher. Not, not too bad per no. teacher. But uh, the really fun things uh, with this is actually the total grant and the numbers of the teachers for the whole uh, project for the five years is actually 3,500 teachers oh my that gosh. we have supported. Okay. And over 70,000 kids have been supported. And now the total the grand sum has been actually uh, 43,500. 435. Yeah. Wow. wow. So that's the total amount so far, and that's going to grow. Okay. So the program, as you do it, um, for sustaining it, is it now the government's going to be able to maintain this? Have you trained teachers to actually be able to do this? Or just, no, just curious. Uh, the, some of the teachers uh, will have their, they can support themselves to, to buy this education, mm -hmm. but not mm -hmm. all of them. So this project must go on, okay. continue. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So the government has not yet uh, adopted the model then that you guys have presented? No. Partly they will do it, but they're not okay. there yet. Okay. They have concentrated on uh, class one to higher level. Oh, I see. And they have forgotten about the preschools. The preschool yeah. gets them ready for school. Oh, yeah. So that's yeah. why uh, this uh, global uh, this project was started by Darshan because they have they need this. Makes sense. Also, yeah. it makes a lot of sense. Mm -hmm. Now, um, preschools with that many s teachers that you've um, graduated out. Is that w in percentage? Do you have any idea what the what that would do for the country? Is that like? 20%, 10%, 50%? Just curious. Mm. It's hard to tell, hard actually. To say. Yeah, it's hard, hard to, to say. say. Yeah. Okay. But uh, what we learned that actually, that had, this had been a great impact, and very big impact, uh, not only for the teachers, the families, the communities, and for the whole country. So it seems to be very important to continue sure. 
yeah. at least for more to three to more five years probably. Um, then we're going to see what's going to happen after that. Okay. And okay. we're going to continue for at least more four or five more years okay. before we. Hope but it sounded done. it sounded like your focus was actually in the lower income areas. Like yeah. Say the North Region was one mm -hmm. of the areas that was in the most need. Yeah. So that, the, that is a good one. Yeah. And the East Coast. Yeah. yeah. Oh, in the East Coast. Yeah. So next time we're going to next grant that's going to be more focusing on the East and the South Coast. Okay. Next time. Okay. But if you look at the picture there, the map, mm -hmm. with all the dots, you can see that it's located all through the whole country. I, so I did yeah. notice that, yeah. 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 And you've covered so most of the, yeah. Yeah, the, the coastline country. also, mm -hmm. so that's, yeah, that sure. is very good. Um, have you worked with and have you met most of the other national figures as far as education? Have you talked to them? Seems to me that that would be a big opportunity for you. And yeah. Something uh, quite unique that you could do. Mm, we haven't, no, no, we haven't met yet. We need to talk to Darshan about that. Oh, yeah. I'm sure he could line that up. <laughs> oh, absolutely. I <laughs> uh, no, he's kind of a great man just to focus on that, too. Yeah, very good. So um, tell me about this. Um, now that you've done that, have either of you experienced what we call the rotary moment, knowing that you did the right thing for the right reasons? Yeah, we did. I think we have maybe the yeah, many special, moments. the right. Many moments. Yeah. yeah. There were actually two girls who was coming and uh, approached us right after the inauguration ceremony and actually uh, tapped us on the shoulder and said, excuse me, can we talk to you? And they were thanking us for that we have supported them with their education wow. and the future. Wow. Because there has been some great impact. Yeah, it's actually what we're doing. Okay, over well, here. we can go into the last picture. Yeah, okay. the last the picture. The last picture, that's a beautiful picture. Yeah, yeah. they told okay. us uh, they, they have been helped so much. Mm -hmm. Otherwise, they have actually ended up on the streets. Mm. That's why we feel it's so much for this, and we're going to continue to help and support everybody that need the help. So, Life this is kind of the real rotary moment for us. They have been going through this uh, teaching uh, last year. So the year, year before. Good, good. And you uh, plan on keeping in touch with them? Do you stay in contact now with them? Absolutely. Nice. Absolutely. We're going to continue Very that nice. too. So. Well, for the two of you, uh, you know, it's an amazing project. And appreciate all you've done. I'm, I'm sure uh, you've changed a lot of lives. As you say, those numbers are huge. And again, my hat's off to you for doing international projects. That's something unique that Rotary does, and not everybody gets to experience that. Mm -hmm. With that, everybody, thank you very much. Take a look at some of the projects being done around the world because it started here in Galita Noontime Club and it's going around the world changing lives. With that, thank you very much and we will see you next time.